Hi everyone, welcome to Imaging Study. Today we are going to see a case of empyma gallbladder. A 42-year-old male patient came with severe right upper abdominal pain. He also complained about a repeated vomiting and the patient was admitted to hospital regarding these problems. His Murphy's sign was positive. Let's see what we have got on ultrasound. Here you can see the section of the gallbladder. It's a magnified image. You can see hypoechoic slurs within which is quite well visualized. The walls are slightly thickened and you can see some pericolicistic collection here also. We have measured the lumen and it is distended which we will show a little bit later. You can see tiny calculi within this hypoechoic slurs. These are microcalculi or soft calculi because you cannot see postreacoustic shadow quite well here. Now we are not focusing on that part. You already can understand that this is a case of acute calculus cholecystitis with biliary slurs. It was also diagnosed 2 to 3 days ago. If you look carefully, you can see there is a motility within this slurs. I am not changing the patient's posture, so it should not move. It is moving due to the sound waves. This phenomenon is known as acoustic streaming. Like when you see the patient with hydrocele, you put the transducer over that and you will see some movements of the particle inside. When you do the pregnancy ultrasound in third trimester, you see the skin shadows of the fetus within the amniotic fluid and they move. This is called the acoustic streaming. Now this streaming doesn't happen for biliary slurs because the slurs is a thick component and after changing the posture, it takes time to move along the gravity. But here you can see it's moving. It suggests that moving particles are not slurs, rather they are pus. Let's see another picture. You can see a distended gallbladder with thickened wall. You can see the moving particles here, which should not be confused with slurs. This is the slurs. The slurs is not moving with the sound waves that is acoustic streaming not happening here. So this acoustic streaming feature confirms it to be a case of empyma gallbladder. You can see a tiny calculus here. Here is the picture, you can see the measurement and the gallbladder lumen is distended. The width of the gallbladder should be less than 4 cm, here you can see it's 4.2 cm. Here you can see the gallbladder wall thickness which is 4.6 mm. In normal cases, it should be less than 3 mm. And the picture with the distended gallbladder on the right and on the left, you can see hypoechoic slurs and tiny echogenic calculi within this slurs without any definite postreacoustic shadows indicating microcalculi or soft calculi. Here is another picture of the tiny calculi within the slurs. Here is another picture of the gallbladder and you can see the thickening of the gallbladder wall with internal slurs and pus. These are the pictures with high frequency ultrasound and you can see hypoechoic slurs. These are pus and these are the tiny calculi. This patient also had mild hepatosplenomegaly. So in summary, a distended gallbladder with thickened and edematous wall is seen with pericolecystic mild collection. The gallbladder lumen shows hypoechoic slurs. And within the slurs, there are tiny echogenic structures without postreacoustic shadow indicating microcalculi or soft calculi. Rest of the lumen contains low-level echoes showing acoustic streaming indicating pus component. There is also mild hepatosplenomegaly. So this features concluded as a case of acute cholecystitis with soft calculi or microcalculi biliary slurs and features of empyma gallbladder. 
Now the take home message. The acoustic streaming can help differentiate pass from slurs in case of empyma. Thank you for watching this video. Don't forget to subscribe our YouTube channel and visit imagingstudy.com for more cases. See you on the next one. Have a nice day.